be strong. Hey everyone, how's it going? I'm Kim, welcome to my channel and welcome to a 30 minute Tabata workout. This workout has four different Tabata circuits. One is going to be all kettlebell, one will be cardio, one will be abs, and then the fourth one is going to do a mixture of all of those. So for this workout, you need a kettlebell and maybe a mat because we will be on the floor. Go ahead, get yourself all set up and when you're ready, we'll get started. All right, warming it up. We're gonna do some hip circles. So take it to the right, take it back, and push those hips forward. Good. So we're opening up through the hips, stretching out through the back of the thighs. We're gonna go one more this direction, and then we're gonna switch directions. So bring it up to center, and then just push it out to the other side. Really try to drive those hips to the side, back, and front. Last three, two, final one. Good, we're gonna bring those arms down and swing them up. Stretch out through the back, deep breath in. Good, really warming up through the shoulders and through the back on this one. We're gonna go four, three, and one. Let's take it to the back here. So come up on the toe, push through the hips, and reach that arm behind you. So we're getting the twist in through our waist here. Last three, two, and one. We're gonna take our feet a little wider than hip width. We're gonna come down, touch the ground, lift it up, then drop into a squat. Hinge touch, lift, down, up. Last two, right here, down, lift. All right, time to add some cardio in, get that heart rate up, so just a jog right on the spot, then take those arms out and up. All right, get yourself in a position so you've got some room in front of you. We're gonna walk out into a plank in four, three, two, one. Arms up, hinge forward, walk it all the way out to plank. Step one leg forward, give it a twist. Take it back down, walk it up. Good, we're gonna do that on the other side. So walk it out, step forward, and twist. One more, take it down. Good, we're gonna walk both feet back out, take it into a down dog, drop one heel followed by the other. Stretch out those calves. All right, let's look center, step one leg forward, followed by the other, inhale the arms up, circle out the arms. Three and four, switch directions. Three and four. Let's go into a walk out and in, just to get those feet. So a ladder walk. I'm gonna take this into a ladder run. In four, three, two, here we go. So just a little faster up on the toes, in and out of that ladder.
five, four, two, and one. Take those toes out to the corner. We're gonna come down into a sumo squat and lift. We're almost done our warm up. We got eight seconds left. Two and one. Okay, we are starting with our kettlebell circuit. So place your kettlebell in front of you. We're gonna do four exercises, two times through. We're gonna start with a clean and press on the right. Then we'll do the left. We have a hand-to-hand -hand swing and a squat in this circuit. So we're gonna come on down with a nice straight back when we grab our kettlebell. You pull it towards you, clean it into place, elbow tucks in, and press. Here we go. Lift, press. Drop it down. We're gonna do the same thing on the other side. And three. Here we go. Clean, press. Good job. Okay, kettlebell's gonna go down on the floor. You're gonna step it back. Toes are pointing forward. We're gonna start with one hand. Come on down, grab that kettlebell, pull it towards you. Pop through your hips, switch at the top. Place the kettlebell down, turn the handle in. Whew. Okay, we're gonna come down, we're gonna squat. We're gonna pull the kettlebell up, right here. Down, lift, down, lift, good. Shoulders are back and down. Inhale, exhale. Keep that chest up towards the ceiling. and drop it. All right, same four exercises. Clean and press with your right in three, two, here we go. Drop it, other side. Here we go. Hand to hand swing. Drop it. Final exercise, squat. Then we're gonna go into our cardio circuit. Here we go. Down, lift. Okay, move the kettlebell aside. We've got a cardio. We are gonna work really hard on this cardio. So we're starting with some pop squats. You're gonna come down and up. All right. 
It's gonna go quick, it's gonna be hard. You're gonna get that heart rate right up. You wanna work as hard as you can on those 20 seconds. Two, one, let's go. Right up on the toes. Good, next one, we're gonna go ladder runs to the side. One, two, three, one, two, three. <sighs> Work, one, two, knee up. One, two, stick that landing right there. Yes. All right, next one is like a burpee. It's called a get down. You're gonna place the hands on the floor, all the way down to the floor, and up. Here we go. Final one, skater. So one foot comes out to the side, leg behind. Here we go. From the top. Pop squat. Lateral, high knees. All right, get down, two more. Then we're on the floor for our ab circuit. Here we go. Skater hops, last one in our cardio. Whew. Nice work, okay, take a rest. We're hitting the floor. I'm gonna work those abs. Oh. All right, time for our abdominal circuit. We're gonna be starting with our obliques. So we're gonna have our legs at tabletop. We're gonna come up and tap the side of our knees right here. Good, side to side. One, two, three, I don't know who else to be. Four, five, six, like they say I can't be fixed. One, two, three, your attention's all I need. Four, five, six, I'll lift the legs all the way up, pull the toes down. Now we're gonna do a toe tap. So we're gonna reach up, try to touch our toes. Here we go. 
lift, release, lift. Get those shoulders right off the floor. Next one is gonna be a scissor leg. So we're gonna grab onto one leg on the shin. The other leg's gonna extend down. Keep that back pushing down. Shoulders off the floor and switch. Drop those feet. For the exercise, we're gonna start in a cannonball position. So bring those knees in towards your chest, lift the shoulders off the floor. Good, tug, extend. Pull everything in nice and tight. Extend, keep your back pushing down in the floor. Nice work. We're gonna take that from the top, then we're on our final Tabata. Whew. Legs back up to that tabletop. Good, keep your back pushing down. We're gonna come up, touch the side of those knees. Extend the legs, toes down. Here we go. Lift, release. One leg out. Extend the opposite leg. Shoulders off the floor. Here we go. Rest. Pull the knees in. Here we go, extend it, pull it in. All right, roll it up, last Tabata. So we're starting with a kettlebell swing, two-handed kettlebell swing. So we're gonna go kettlebell cardio ab, kettlebell cardio ab, kettlebell cardio with an ab. Step back. We go in four, so bend in the knee, hinge it, grab your kettlebell, pull it towards you, here we go. Place it down. Whew. All right, next one we're gonna squat. Squat, toe touch. Here we go. Squat, lift. Down on the floor, we're gonna go into a full extension plank with a shoulder tap. <sighs> Step one foot out, followed by the other. Good, tap the shoulder.
step it up. Kettlebell's gonna go in between your feet. We're gonna do some rows. Alternate hand rows. Hinge it, keep your back straight. Row release. High knees with two jump jacks. So we're gonna go four high knees, two jump jacks. High knees are right here. Here we go. One, two, three, four. Down to the floor. Oh, extend those legs or an arms overhead. We're gonna do an alternating V up. So you're gonna lift one foot, touch the toe, extend. Good, you could come all the way off the floor if you want. Oh, bring it back up. Last two exercises. We're gonna do an alternating deadlift. Kettlebell between your feet. Hinge it forward with a straight back. Lift, squeeze your glutes. Release, squeeze. One more move to go after this. Then we're done. It's a quick one today. But we're gonna take some time and really stretch it out. Okay, down to the floor. We wanna do a cardio and abs, so we're gonna mountain climb. 20 seconds, take it out into your plank. Here we go, knees in. Two, and one, drop down. Oh, nice work. Okay, I'm gonna take us through a really nice long stretch today. So, if you need to, grab some water. Catch your breath. We're gonna start on our knees. I'm gonna take my hands behind my back, interlace my fingers, and just open up the chest. Big breath. Good. So I'm gonna be opening up through the front of the body here. Now I'm gonna tuck my toes into the floor, release my hands, and I'm gonna take them onto my low back and start to arch. Pushing my hips forward. And if this is enough for you, you can really feel that, stay here. You wanna go deeper, take it onto the heels. Lift it up, release the feet down, drop your glutes down to your heels, and we're gonna walk our hands forward into a child's pose. Just slowly walk your hands over to one direction, getting that stretch in through the side of the body. Slowly walk it over to the other side. Good, bring it center, come up onto all fours. From here, I'm gonna tuck my tailbone down towards the floor, arch through that low back and then push through the up back. And reverse direction, tailbone lifts, belly button down to the floor, chest comes through, you look center. And repeat. Maybe we 
exhale inhale last time good come to a neutral spine we're going to tuck the toes into the floor and go into a down dog lifting up drop your heels to the floor relax your head Come up on the toes, step one foot forward, drop down to the knee. Good. I'm gonna go back into that down dog. Hold for a breath. And then come forward, step the opposite leg forward, drop that back knee and push that hip down to the floor. Good, we're gonna tuck that back toe into the floor, lift the knee and then just step it forward. And from here, I'm just gonna place my chest down towards my thighs. Let that whole upper body hang down. You can grab on behind your shins if you like. Then bring those hands forward and see if you can straighten out those legs as best as you can. Good, slowly roll yourself up. Bring the shoulders back and down. We're gonna take a nice big wide stance here. And then I'm going to take my hands on my hips. Toes are in, heels are out. I'm gonna hinge it forward. Bring my hands down to the floor. And I'm gonna walk my hands over to one side, bringing that chest towards that thigh. Switch sides. And bring it center, place one hand in the middle and give it a little twist. Switch sides. Bring it back to center, walk your feet in. This time we're gonna lift up with a straight back, so reach those arms forward, out and back. We're gonna stretch out the quads. So you're gonna grab onto one foot, bring the knee in to meet the other. Push your hip forward and squeeze your glutes, taking that foot and pushing it into your hands. Good, switch sides. Release it down, take one arm on top of the other, come into an eagle arms right here. Inhale, exhale. And switch which arm is on top. Good, release the arms, shake it out, take a deep breath up. 
exhale it down one more time big breath up and exhale it down that's it guys you did great i hope you enjoyed the workout that's it for me today you take care and i'll see you on the next one